Let me show you three ways to remove background easily in Photoshop. Go to select and choose subject. Add a layer mask. That's the easiest way, but some images needs more work. Let me show you another way to remove background. Go to tools and choose the quick selection tool. You can adjust the brush size from the top left corner. Start selecting your subject until it is fully selected. Use the Alt key to remove extra parts of the selection. You can download these images from the description below. Now that we have selected the subject, add a layer mask. Our sponsor for today is ClickMagic.com. In ClickMagic you can easily remove backgrounds 100% automatically in just a few seconds. ClickMagic delivers amazing results even on images with the most challenging edges, tiny details and other complex scenarios. Now let's try removing the background in Photoshop using artificial intelligence on the same image. As you can see, the artificial intelligence in Photoshop didn't do a good job on this particular image. While in ClickMagic website, the background is nicely removed. You can download the preview low quality image, or get full resolution images with the subscription plan. Now let's try another image. ClickMagic has the latest AI technology that delivers stunning results. No software downloads or tech skills needed. I would highly recommend ClickMagic to anyone needing a background image removal service. Now here's the third way to remove the background in Photoshop. In this image, if we tried to use the select subject as we did before, the artificial intelligence doesn't do a good job. Let's undo this, and try the quick selection tool as we did before. Start selecting your subject until it is fully selected. Use the Alt key to remove extra parts of the selection. Here is the difficult part to select. That's why in this particular image, we should use the pen tool to be more precise. Let's undo this mask and use the pen tool instead. If you want to learn how to use the pen tool, I have made a detailed tutorial about it. Check the link in the description. I will speed the process. Keep on watching. Now right click and choose make selection. Add a layer mask. Now again we are going to use the pen tool to select these missing parts and adjust the mask. Right click and choose make selection. Click on the mask. Make sure the foreground color is white. Press delete. Click anywhere to deselect. Now again we are going to use the pen tool to select these missing parts and adjust the mask. Right click and choose make selection. 
Click on the mask. Press delete. Click anywhere to deselect. Let's do the same thing for the rest. I will speed this part. Keep on watching. This is the last part. Keep on watching. To save the image with transparent background, go to File, Export, Save for Web. Choose PNG24 and then press Save. That's it. Leave a comment below and I will try to answer all of your comments.